Man, I should start over. This sucks already. Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome to my humble garage. It's a disaster. It's only used for storing one badass Kawasaki. <laughs> Here's my trusty assistant for today's uh, video. Amos, say hi to the people. All right, I don't know if you guys follow Motonasi or not. Very good guy, very popular guy on YouTube. Uh, I follow Modernosity, and he put out a ram mount video, which was awesome. And it was so good that I went ahead and bought his setup, which is excellent. Uh, but unfortunately, his setup did not work for my bike. So I didn't think I would have to put out a video, but there's some other folks out there that ride the ZX-10R. And unfortunately, because his setup did not work out, I had to get another piece. His setup went through the triple tree. And uh, I don't know if you saw my Instagram photo or not, but my steering, steering stabilizer is in the way of his setup. So I had to go ahead and get another piece. And... I got a couple requests. I didn't think I would have to put out a video because he did such a good job. Just like the Frober said, he bought the same setup. Uh, it was very good, very good installation video. But what what he bought was the <clears throat> the stem mount, one of those ball connectors. Say what? The RAM X grip for your phone. Awesome. And so since his setup didn't work for me, I had to get this uh, RAM one inch ball to mount on my bike. And I did some research, uh, I looked on some Kawasaki forums and uh, there's a screw underneath the triple tree that connects the stable, I mean the, uh, <laughs> the steering stabilizer. So there's a bolt underneath, and uh, let me just show you what I'm talking about. So I went ahead and removed my windscreen nuts, just so we can make this easier, and you can see what I'm talking about. Hopefully you can see what I'm talking about. Underneath the triple tree, there is this bolt that I already loosened up. This bolt connects part of the steering stabilizer. So, in essence, this will be mounted within that bolt. All right, so the only things that you'll need for this install is a 10, mi 10 millimeter socket wrench and an Allen wrench to remove your, rinse, your windscreen if you like. I've already loosened it up for quicker install hopefully. So next step, what I recommend since there's a decent size hole there, you, you use a washer to uh, set that back up. So get yourself a handy washer. Just throw that bad boy back on. Alright, so get that in there nice and tight. All you need now is your bracket piece and of course your rim mount. And the way that works is you just tighten it down onto the balls. Say what? See, 
See that thing ain't moving anywhere. Not sure if that's where I want it or not. So we'll put it on there. Screw it in. And wazam. And you can adjust it any way you want. That's what's so awesome about these mounts is that uh, they're flexible. I mean, they'll move in any which way. And now you can see it's no longer in the way. It clears the steering dampener with the uh, ease. And you can adjust it the way you want it. So while you're riding, you can file GPS, you can turn on your music, you can do whatever you want. Let me jump on here and see what it looks like from this view. All right, so that's what it looks like set up. Key B right there. Clears your steering dampener for the Kawasaki. I just have to put my windscreen back on and you can see now on the windscreen the top two had these uh, style Allen wrench nuts bolts so one thing I forgot when I was taking it out was they're in here like so all you gotta do is push them through don't try to pull them back up or you might break your windscreen. So let's put this bad boy back on. Now when you're riding, you can easily check out where you're going. You can play with, uh, you can check Instagram, check me out. You can check Facebook, my page. You can ride. Now the only thing left to do is to see if it's wheelie proof. Alright, thanks again for watching guys. Real simple in install. If I can do it, anybody can do it. Uh, thanks again for Motonosity for showing everybody that awesome mount. Thanks guys. Have a good one. This is the end, beautiful friend. And of course, I dropped the bolt. <laughs>